Good morning! It is Friday, July 3rd, and I'm super excited that I'm working from home. I didn't have to get up early, shower, and head into the office. <clears throat> uh, I did get up. I did shower, but it was at my own pace. It's almost 8 o'clock. I've already hooked up my computer and everything to start working for my eight hours from home. And I even made myself a grilled cheese sandwich. And I, if I do say so myself, it is, it is delicious. Oh my goodness. started putting regular cheese on it then I put this pepper jack cheese where it comes in different increments of spicy I like the hot and I know that's really weird because I say I do not like spicy but it's good but this time I only have like the mild and then I put some turkey bacon bits on it very very good so I've been working for about three hours right now trying to take tickets doing research on my old tickets and making sure everything's up to date and I'm tagging stuff properly. Um, that's about it. I am really considering like 99% sure about going to the zoo after 4 p.m. and heading that way to go to, it's something called, let's see here, uh, tonight for cool nights. I'm not quite sure what that means, but I'm going to head to the Houston Zoo and see what that's about. I now have six subscribers to my channel. Yay! I want to give a shout out to Kylie, Abna, and Sharonica. That actually shows up on who who subscribes because some people keep that private which I'm okay with but if you decide to open it up I give you a shout out too whoop whoop yay I'm so excited I'm finally off to the zoo finished working up got dressed and let's see if I can figure out how to get there thank goodness for star see you at the zoo I'm gonna see everything. I have saw the giraffe so far. Those were awesome, mixed with zebras and ostriches. Otra, whatever. You know what I'm trying to say. And then I'm trying to find the polar bears because that's what I really want to see in the elephant. So I didn't get to see the gorillas. They're hiding. Didn't see the polar bears. Maybe they don't have them in Houston. Now I'm gonna go on the gorilla walk area to see if I can see it up here. to the entrance of the zoo to head home. I've been here for a couple hours. 
it was a good time I enjoyed it I will come back because I got a cup that I can get 99 cent refills on I'm definitely coming back so I made it back from the zoo the Houston Zoo and for the most part I really did enjoy it but at the same time I ended up getting really sad um, just thinking about those animals being caged up and not being able to be free that kind of uh, that kind of really really did bother me um, and like I wouldn't go there all the time maybe like for when my family or friends come to visit that's something that we can go do and check out but um, yeah I was really another thing that I was disappointed about was there was no polar bears I love the polar bears when I lived in Indianapolis we went to the Indianapolis Zoo and I stood there forever watching those polar bear well I guess it was one polar bear one polar bear swim in the water so graceful and it was beautiful but okay back to Houston um, I really did enjoy the giraffes. Those are pretty cool. The zebras. Um, there's uh, there's these other animals. I didn't I didn't catch the name of it, but they had these huge horns that I really thought were very cool. And I have to say, my favorite was the giraffe. When I saw them walking, uh, they were so graceful. And for being that tall and having that long neck and that black tongue, they were very, very graceful. Not like the tongue has anything to do with them being graceful, but I just thought that was kind of different. Uh, but that's it I'm really tired now um, I work this morning and this afternoon I talked to my family my sweet little Sophia called me uh, probably not on purpose but she dialed it and then I got to see her for a little bit which made my day and I'm looking forward to tomorrow I don't have to get up and do anything like I'm not scheduled for anything uh, tomorrow evening I am gonna go back to, I think it's the Outdoor Miller Theater. They're going to be playing, the orchestra is going to be playing. They're going to have fireworks tomorrow. And that's right by the zoo. So I kind of walked over there today to know where I'm going. And I'm going to do that tomorrow evening. And that's, that's it for Saturday. And, you know, just a normal trying to get everything together, cleaned up and tidied up. Because I really didn't do that last week. Uh, that's it. I hope you guys had a great day and happy 4th of July and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye. Mm -hmm.